Good morning. In this segment, I'm going to talk about a small plant or a weed called Biden's Alba. In Tamil, it is known as Kinnathu Poond. It is a medical herb capable of curing many diseases. Biden's Alba, which belongs to the family called Astarachie, Astarachie, is most commonly known as shepherd's needles, beggar tricks, Spanish needles, or butterfly needles. Biden's Alba means two two toothed. In the seed, you can see the tooth. They are like two teeth. Biden's means two tooth, describing the two projections found at the top of the seeds. And Alba refers to the white ray florets. The plant is found in tropical and subtropical regions of India, North America, Asia, South America, and Africa, situated in gardens, roadsides, farm fields, and disturbed sites. Biden's alba is an annual or short-lived perennial, which is considered a weed in the United States. However, Biden's alba leaves are edible and can be used as medicinal remedies. Nearly anyone you ask about Biden's alba, who knows it will say it's a weed, not a pretty one, not a useful one, not a nice one. Yet honey production everywhere would be hurt without the Biden's family. Biden's is in the aster family, a dicot with a root that goes vertical, not horizontal. That also makes it a composite and a relative of the sunflower. There are hundreds of species. Authorities differ on the exact amount. The common names include beggar ticks, bar marigold, stick seeds, Spanish needles, tick seeds, tick seed sunflowers, and pitchfork weed. This is because its seed has two prongs on it that sometimes four stick to almost anything. And in the fact, Byron's means two tooth. As for the edibility of the Byron species, several are mentioned as edible. As for the medicinal implication, in 1991, Egyptian researchers documented Byron's pilosa, an antimicrobial activity against a wide array of bacteria, including Salmonella, Staphylococcus, Neisseria, Ganoria, Klebsiella pneumonia, and against tuberculosis. It is also good for malaria, snake bite, and as anti leukemia activity. Research shows it lowers, as mentioned, blood sugar and blood pressure, stimulates the immune system, and is anti inflammatory. inflammatory. The powdered seeds are a tropical anesthetic and aid clotting. There are also some reports the seeds might be good for prostate, prostate issues. The nutritional composition of the Biden's pilosa per 100 gram edible portion is water 85 milligrams, calories 43, protein 3.8 gram, fat 0.5 gram, carbohydrates 8.4 gram, fiber 3.9, beta carotene 1,800 milligram. Another study found 111 milligram of calcium and 2.3 milligram of iron. These researchers also recommend you don't eat the leaves raw because of a high saponin content. As a pot herb, they are excellent with many fine qualities. They are available all year around. Keep very well and don't reduce in size when cooked. They are a bit tangy, just let them sit cooked a few minutes. They store well, cooked texture is good, wine made from Biden's is called Sinitsit. Incidentally, dried leaves of the uh, Biden's Alba also make 
a good tobacco substitute. It's good for the smokers, cigarette smokers, cigar smokers. So Biden's Alba leaves are alternative and it doesn't contain nicotine. In 1962, Professor Julia Morton, who wrote many papers for the Journal of Economic Botany, recommended Biden's Alba become a commercial crop. It's a miraculous plant. You don't have to take care of it. A plant will take care of itself. And uh, it is a medicinal herb. We need to protect it and preserve it for the future generations. Enjoy. Goodbye.